I have an interesting chemistry video for you tonight. Here we've got a cell. This is just copper sulfate and acid and stuff. I'm just doing electroplating here. This isn't actually what I'm talking about. What I'm talking about is here I've got a piece of aluminum. Now aluminum is more reactive than copper, so it should react with it, right? But the interesting thing that you may or may not know about copper is copper sulfate and aluminum do not react. You can see there's a drop on there, and it's just not reacting. The interesting thing is, if I s set this down, in this jar, I've just got a few salt crystals in water, so it's just a little brine here. If I drip this on top, Now you can see it's reacting, it's producing copper metal and the solution is getting a little less blue and it's making lots of hydrogen bubbles too. So the key is chloride catalyzes the reaction. Now after lots and lots of circuit board etching I have this bastard that's uh, oh, about three, a little over three liters of copper chloride. Really dark stuff. I've got a lot of it. Now, for your amusement, I have here a jug with some assorted aluminum cuttings, and I have aluminum chips. Ooh, this is gonna be messy. And now I'm gonna make one hell of a mess. Cloud of steam got the camera. Fogged up everything. <laughs> that was just a blub of it. I've still got a lot left. Maybe half a liter is in there. You want to see more? <laughs> 